now that we have both uh, probes in single tank of water solution as you can see there is no uh, a, a pH ground loop or anything else just reading EC of 1.34 and going up and pH is 6.64 and now let's look at the radio now that we've done the calibration and our units connected now let's stream the this data wirelessly um, with the help of the radios uh, now what we did is when we calibrated we disconnected the uh, the RX pin of the uh, Arduino from the radio uh, so we can uh, be able to load the sketch. So let's connect that back. Let's connect that back. Just one pin. Remove this. We do not need this anymore. And it's a standalone unit now. It's controlling the pH and EC. And it will stream the data. Um, this receiver right here this is the receiver and uh, it's just the Arduino Uno and a radio inside and I have this pin this is the RX pin again anytime you need to load the software you need to unpin this it's just a pin load your sketch and then connect it back okay and now let's it's so easy that now it's it's Let's connect the RX and view the data on our laptop. Let's connect to the laptop. Uh, let's get out of the sketch. And let's, um, we have another sketch for it. It's called the uh, readout. Uh, this is right here. I'll find a readout right here. Okay, and we look at the monitor. Oh, it's on COM3. Okay, and let's look at the monitor. Uh, it's looking for, I think I have two sketches on that's so fine. It's just a receiver so this can be about 150 feet away with your laptop and uh, you can you can stream all the information here and from here you can channel it to Wi-Fi or uh, any other application which I have not played with so I will not go into that uh, port 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 com 7 Here's the data. The baud rate's 9600. Now let's trigger a a pump, which it shows all the pumps are off. Now the EC should be on. You can see EC is on and EC readings is zero. Let's put it here. 
should you see should read now point yeah that's about right it should be go it should go up to four four hundred eighty Well, let's calibrate our uh, EC244 480. There you go. And let's put it back to tank. Now that's above 1.0. Um, as you can see, the <clears throat> when both pH probe and EC probe are in the water, there's a slight, slight crosstalk between two of them. You can compensate that with the pH, with the pH uh, seven. Should, should be fine so as you can see it's streaming the information here wirelessly basically and that's about it thanks